Reed on the slant. The catch is made by Malachi Corley for the touchdown. Here, Corley just comes underneath the two receivers. Good quick pass. For Salter from the shotgun. Pressure. This is what Salter can do, and he takes it to the house. 20 yards for the touchdown. How I know it was a quarterback draw. Watch 53, Jordan White, the center. He's out in front, lead blocking, and they run it so well, he doesn't even have anyone to hit. For Lucas Carnero. Trey not in a snap, Tom Ellard holds, and the kick is good. What has to happen there to get that? Low man, you gotta get low. Salter, he's got a man wide open. The catch for the touchdown, C.J. Daniels. Heads up. 47 yards. There's peekabooing inside because of the run game. Salter steps up, throws a strike to C.J. Daniels. Hutchinson goes in motion. Reed. Again, same situation, but into double coverage. And they're going to call it an interception. Kobe Singleton picks it off for Liberty. Tim, we'll see. I don't think it touched the ground when he rolled over. It definitely doesn't. It's on the, the receiver right here. It's rolling over. It's anybody's ball right now. Singleton. In motion goes Venn. They flip it out to him. Victor Venn to the pylon. Down shy of the goal. Yeah, the side judge, side judge says oh, touchdown now. Now they say touchdown. So he's checking with the headline judge because it doesn't look like his knee went down. Yeah, I, I don't see anything there to, to overturn. On a second and goal from the two, Bedgood in motion. Cooley walking in basically for the touchdown. Quinton Cooley, fourth TD of the night for Liberty. And you get Cooley, just square those shoulders, doesn't get touched as he walks into the end zone. Messer goes in motion over the middle. Instead, he's got a wide open man. It is Elijah Young, and no one's going to touch him. Young's in for the touchdown. How did that happen? Well, not only do you get the third down conversion, you get a touchdown. And no one rotates over. There's no safety in the middle, and it's just an easy throw to Elijah Young. And down the sideline he goes. You're not going to get an easier touchdown than that. And here he goes, Caden Salter, look out, has blockers downfield and gets out of bounds inside the 15-yard line. Another red zone trip here for the Liberty Flames. That's a 34-yard run. Back to the six on the O-line with Tucker, Mitchell, Graham, White, Gatlin, and Gray. That good. With that blocking, he's in. Touchdown. He gets the unsportsman like which you yeah. usually don't see out of a quarterback. Yeah, I, that's a that's, that's a, a touchdown. touchdown. That's yeah, wise. and you had a beautiful daughter too, Delaney. Yes, gonna be you. five years old. So I guess if you want to have a child and you're a play-by-play, -play, <laughs> specifically a girl, work with me. Start working with you. Look at this pass. River Helms has it. Touchdown. Western Kentucky, just like that. Put six back on the board on a 63-yard strike from Reed to hell. The play, what's going on and here? He goes in motion and just no one's out there. You see the confusion. Two linebackers in a safety underneath. Confusion, the safety on top doesn't. You know, Liberty, probably thinking about running it. They've got 16 rushing first downs tonight. Can they get one through the air? Yes, and they're going to get a touchdown. Caught for the score by Trayon Sibley. Just a backbreaker. You see Salter rolls out. So they're going to have a run pass option. He just kind of throws it behind you know, the defender. Coming up on two minutes left in the contest. Reed on the fourth down goes. Corley, he's got it. Touchdown, Western Kentucky. What a catch. Tremendous throw by Austin Reed. Puts it perfect in last second. Because a lot of times the DBs are reading the hands of the receivers.